For 2019, the Solicitor General earns a total of 16.9 million, mostly from additional compensation and honorarium. He is the first Solicitor General in years to be in the top of the list. Solicitor General Jose Calida is now the second highest paid government official, earning a total of 16.9 million from 2019, according to the Commission on Audit COA 2019 report on salaries and allowances or ROSA. The top earner for 2019 is former United Coconut Planters Bank UCPB President Higinio Makadaig Jr. who resigned in July. Despite resigning mid-year, the Duterte-nominated Makadaig still earned $20.47 million. Kalida is the first solicitor general in years to get to the top 10 of government earners, usually occupied by officials from the banking and financial sectors. In 2017, Kalida was top 4. In 2018, he was top 6. Since 2009, which is far back as Rosa's go in COA's online database, solicitor general did not make it to the top 10. Kalida Kalida's basic salary for 2019 was only 2.9 million, but he earned 11.9 million from personal economic relief allowances or PERA, additional compensation, and honorarium. The Solicitor General earned 288,500 in allowances, 550,618 in bonuses, incentives, and benefits, and 312,000 in discretionary expenses and miscellaneous. Kalida's allowances had been flagged by COA before and has been a long-time dispute even in other agencies. While allowances are allowed, COA Circular Number 85-25-E states that allowances should not exceed 50% of the annual salary. For example, in 2017, Kalida received $8.37 million in allowances but earned a $1.28 million basic salary only. For COA, his allowances should not have exceeded $910,000 which is 50% percent of his 1.82 million basic salary. Instead, Kalida collected an excess of 7.46 million in allowances according to COA. Kalida's government earnings steadily grew in the last three years, specifically his PERA, additional compensation and honorarium. His allowances and discretionary expenses went down in 2019 and his bonuses and incentives only went up by 120,000 but his PERA, additional compensation and honorarium went up by almost 4 million. The third top earning government official is Banco Central ng Pilipinas or BSP Governor Benjamin Diokno, followed by UCPB Executive Vice President Eugelio Catabran and BSP Deputy Governor Maria Almasara Amador. The top 10 and the following slots belong to officials of BSP and UCPB, but up there in number 13 is Chief Justice Justado Peralta with an annual earning of 10.36 million. Since 2000, 2009, retired Chief Justice Lucas Bersamin and retired Justice now Marinduque Governor Presbyterio Velasco Jr. have been the only two justices in the top 10 highest paid government officials. The top 20 is likewise filled with financial officials including those from the Development Bank of the Philippines but Senior Associate Justice Estela Perlas Bernabe is now number 16 with an annual earning of 10.21 million pesos.